Listen, you wanted to be a celebrity. You wanted to be a celebrity. You wanted to be a celebrity. You want to hit me. Okay guys, um, welcome to my channel. Um, I'm here to address the mind of business issue in Nigeria. Now, an hour ago, I stumbled on a post, a blogger posted something, and I checked out the comments below. Now, the comments were, it is not about me, it's, generally speaking, it's about bloggers, vloggers, um, YouTubers, whatever. Now, here's the thing. People come, they check out the post and most of the comments were why don't you mind your business? Why don't you mind your business? You should be minding your business. This, that, that, this. This person is a blogger. Okay? Now, what is the work of a blogger? To post news if it's an entertainment blog, it's going to post news about entertainment. If it is um, just news, generally, he posts news now the thing is I think these people should be worried about themselves and not the bloggers you tell the blogger to mind his business it is not about me it's about like I'm, I'm speaking out for all bloggers out there now you check out oh can you lawyer blasted or pastor be man or Stephanie uh, Tobo is at it again with Apostle Suleiman or Stephen Otobo, the truth between Stephen Otobo and Apostle Suleiman. And you click. I hope you guys understand what I'm trying to say. And you come on, on that person's page and say, mind your business. Now, when you see something like that, you see catchy titles and you click, you want to know about what's going on about these people. Are you minding your business? I don't get it. You want to know about these people. Now, because the bloggers know you want to know, they dig it out for you to know. Now you get to know and you tell this blogger whether it's um maybe Nigerians don't know what it really means to be a blogger. You post about other people's stuffs. Now you should go tell the celebs or to be celebs. They should just travel out of the country and stay away from cameras, stay away from social media. Because let me tell you something. Some of these celebrities that you say, oh, mind your business. In fact, let me just go straight to the point. This mind your business thing, Laura Ikeji remains at her sister's house even after getting married. A question mark. So a lot of comments were, mind your business. And you click to know. Now, apart from that, we all know that even people like Laura Ikeji do things to get attention. Now, people pay bloggers to talk about them. That is how crazy this, this whole thing is. A lot of people that doesn't, they don't know how it works just come online. Some celebs that you see now paid. Now, I'll give a scenario. Now, a video um, surfaced online then. And Igazalia was asking a paparazzi to leave her alone. That was a problem. Leave me alone. Just leave me alone. Now, this friend that, that was with um, Igazalia was like, she doesn't want you to follow her and this person said I'm going to court I'm going to sue you because she's trying to assault me why is it like that because there are laws for things like this so as far as he's concerned he hasn't passed his boundary the law knows that he's doing his job so you can't tell him to mind his business the, now there's just a reply leave LA if you don't want to be a celeb you could go back to somewhere else leave social media if you don't want the attention, you wanted the celebrity life. Yeah, it is. Celebrity life is not a bed of roses all the time. You don't have. There are some. Your privacy. And on video, you assaulted him. I no. assaulted him. I fucking spit on him. Yeah, that's fucking. assault. Whatever. You have AIDS. Don't I'm fucking. AIDS now. Okay. I got, I got AIDS now. Maybe I got Ebola. Okay. I hope you have Ebola. I hope you die. You're a fucking. Listen. Con. You wanted to no, be a celebrity. Don't fucking follow me. You I wanted to be a celebrity. You Your wanted to be a celebrity. Stop. Stop it! She's gonna hit me! She's gonna hit me! You freaking psycho! Stop! You're in a store! Listen! You're in a store! Listen! Listen! 
No, that's not the that's way what it they works, want. That's what they want. That's what they want. You think you're just going to get the red you're carpet? Painful. You're not going to get the red carpet. You want your private life. The right. Then don't be famous. Shut the fuck up. Go live in Nebraska. No paparazzi no. here. You live in LA. Being a musician LA. doesn't give you the Listen. right to sneak into a supermarket Listen. and take photographs of Listen, somebody buying any like that. That's not a public space. It's private. You're inside a store. You're in a public space. You're in a public space. It's not okay. You're in a public space. You're in a public space. I will have people with me do that it. will do get bodyguards then. to get, remove you. Listen, I will. Get bodyguards. Will. You're I rich. Will. Get bodyguards. I will, sweetheart. You can't be fucking living the life and expect no paparazzi there. I will offer you to tell anybody Listen, to you're life. famous. You're famous. You're a freak. 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 All right, I'm a freak. I'm a fucking freak. So I think Nigerians should start thinking in this direction that maybe you get that attention. People start looking for you. Now, if you as a viewer or as a reader if you're minding your business i don't think you should be reading or watching entertainment news because you're minding your business because why would you want to know if you actually mind your business and after watching it you talk about it with someone else but what this bloggers does is it goes online and make money with it posting on, this, on social media accounts by posting on his blog why you you're making nothing you just talk about it with your friends and you come online and i'm blast a blogger who is trying to use that energy, channel that energy to earn money for himself and also ditch out news for people to know what's going on. So, I'm telling you, confirm, AY, a comedian, he said he was driving at Alaba. Then he saw someone who wants to sell his city. Uh, then he was still growing, he was still like struggling. Someone tried to sell his city. AY life comedy or I don't know, I don't know the that what it's all about but someone was trying to sell that to him but he said he was happy because people could actually sell his stuff out there people could actually market his CD out there he got to a point in his life he was among those who were against Alaba market who said Alaba market must be closed down why when he was coming up as a comedian <laughs> he was so happy People will go to Alaba Market to sell their seed, not official. Just give it out anyhow, as long as you're held it. People pay, and when they get to that height, I mean, look at people like Indakiji. Indakiji used to say something, even though I don't really go or read her blogs, but she used to say something. That when you guys are coming up, this is what you say. You, uh, you can do anything to, to get that fame. But when you're there, you started criticizing those who helped you get there. Including bloggers. Including, including YouTubers. Vloggers, whatever you do, as long as you talk about entertainment, or as long as you talk about this person. So guys, I don't know how this is going, but just let me know what you think. I just, I'm just thinking out loud. Just um, let me know what you think about this in the comment section below. And um, I'll... I can't wait to to check out your opinion. Just let me know what you think about this in the comment section below. That's basically everything. I still have more to say, but because of time, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Some people might find it offensive, or some people might not like it. But if you like this video and you did enjoy it, give it a thumbs up and share with your friends. Um, subscribe if you're just watching for the first time for more videos. Usually, this is not what I do. I do entertainment. I do vlogs. I do. Uh, pranks but these days I haven't been doing pranks so I do vlogs and entertainment stuff uh, so that's what I do um, so thanks for watching and we'll see you next time peace